Welcome back to I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here. It's just after 10 past 7 on Friday morning here in Australia. 7, 11 actually. 7, 11. Well done. Is it going to change? No! no. <laughs> now then, we've already, damn, we've already heard from George and David about their jungle experiences. And now it's time for Martina and Joe. Although before we do, can I uh, just say what a great time we've had. Yes, this year we haven't wasted a haven't single wasted day. We've been surfing, we've had some games of football, mm -hmm. a bit of tennis, a bit of golf. Uh, and then there was that day we flew through the asteroid shower, destroyed the evil empire's yeah. space fleet and saved the entire world. Yeah. That PlayStation was worth every penny. It's great. <laughs> and here's Joe and Martina on what the last three weeks have done for them. We did get off with a bang because we had to jump out of an airplane. The acceleration was amazing and I had my mouth open and I was like, wow, look at this! An experience to remember for the rest of our lives. Hey! I had a bush battle with Joe with the, with the water, trying to keep the water from uh, getting run down in this barrel and Joe won fair and square. No. <laughs> then uh, we have sort of a playoff. That was the worst thing I've done in my life, being in the coffin. Uh, you have no sense of anything. Oh, it was very, very uncomfortable. Talk about being out of your comfort zone. Okay, I've had it. Get me out of here. Okay. Well done. Just in time. Carnage trial was custom made for me. <laughs> I love the trial. That was my favorite. Oh, favorite part. Oh dear. Oh, sh <laughs> There's none of them. <laughs> My best moment was uh, watching uh, watching Esther putting out the fire. How many items are I got well about done. fire safety, for Christ's sake? <laughs> 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 that just keep going, you know, and you win one and then you're like happy that you won the match. Oh my god, I gotta play 20 more. <laughs> My time in the jungle has been amazing. It's been an amazing journey. The first day I put myself up for, for the first challenge. <laughs> I was petrified. I screamed like a girl. <laughs> to win the first one, it, it was brilliant. And it, and it, and it gave us the right to have the, the home camp. And the home camp was luxury compared to the away camp. Yeah! Bravo. Thank you. Thank you so uh, much. Yeah. Look at this. I was greeted like an absolute hero. And I remember the first day I walked into camp and had a big red bus. There was all these little lanterns everywhere. A roaring fire going with like logs around it. And I just thought, this place is magical. Oh, we make a lovely couple, Jim. <laughs> Don't we? <laughs> now that could be incriminating. <laughs> He smiled and I thought, I like this man. I'm very, very, very comfortable with my sexuality. So that doesn't bother me at all. Kissing him, cuddling him. I just wanted I just wanted to touch him. I just wanted to spend time with him. We just sparked up this relationship. Come on, Joey! Doing the stuff that I've done, the adventures that I've had. I'm truly going to go home, a different boy to the boy that come in here. And I've made so many good friends in here. And I wouldn't change, I wouldn't change my time in the jungle for a million, a million dollars. So we've heard from all four of them now, but only three will be here this time tomorrow. And it's all down to you, it's in your hands. Now, as regular viewers of I'm a Celebrity Get Me Out of Here will know, every care is taken to ensure absolute authenticity on this show. Mm. Everyone on the team goes to great lengths to maintain the show's jungle theme. The food is authentic. Australian bush tucker, the celebrities wash down there in the creek. Everything is cooked on a genuine campfire. And in yesterday's celebrity chest, David and Martina found a giant white teapot in the middle of the jungle. 
Can you see it? Can you see it yet? No? You can't see it. Come on, David. Love pause, I'm telling you. I think we're walking around in circles, you know? That's a big teapot. Oh, that's so funny. It's funny as well. Look at that. I'm a little teapot, short and stout. I fire tea balls from my spout. When I hit the target, tea falls out. Catch it all, then drain it out. <laughs> so turn it on. We put the ball through here. and goes out there. But what's the target? Oh, there are the targets right there. The plate. Yeah. Oh, this is going to be fun. <laughs> yeah, because I know what job I've got. <laughs> See, I think we need to hit the target when I hit it. Then we get a little water from there coming out of there. You need to catch it here and pour it here. It was a huge teapot. Uh, yeah, we had a cup of tea, have a little tea party, throw some sandwiches around. No. You sure you know what you're doing? I know what I'm doing. Okay. And now you're going to stand over here. Hopefully I'll hit a target. Okay. We both figured that I had slightly better hand-eye coordination and I was going to be able to hit the targets a little more often than, than David because I've been hitting targets all my life. Is this how you did Wimbledon? This is how you win Wimbledon, baby. Yeah. the best teapot I've ever seen. Uh, that was a lot of fun. Come on, you can do it. No! Ah! If we hit a target, the water bucket is going to tilt <laughs> and fill up uh, David's teapot, which he was holding on top of his helmet. It looks so cute. Oh, There's God. nothing in there. <laughs> There's nothing in there? You mean I... Uh, Duck. Okay, lift up. Four. I'm lifting up. I'm standing up. <laughs> okay, that's it. Get it! Every drop was precious because so much water coming into the teacup, it was splattering right out again. Keep tilting, keep tilting, every last drop. All right, we have movement. I said, let me put the balls in and you target it. And then I'll run back and catch the water like a fool. Think about, oh! No, no, not too long. Once we started doing that, we started hitting the target, which meant David was getting wet a lot. <laughs> it's only water. I know it's water. I know it's going to happen. But it just makes me go... <laughs> of course, David had the much worse job of standing under the bucket. <laughs> he took it by command. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, you're getting so wet. No, you think it's funny. Martina never offered once to change place. Not once. Okay, tilt, 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 tilt. Okay. okay. Now try to stick, try to stick. We got it close enough to the top where I sort of snuck a, snuck a little branch in there. Oh. Come on, gently, 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 Martin, gently. Oh, boom! Oh. Yeah! We have a yeah. heat! Yeah! We're going to tap it off! Oh, 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 oh. I thought I'd never do that. Oh. Come on, Keith. We're in, we're in, we're in. All right, Darren. Hold it down. Okay. David Bandy standing in the middle of a jungle with a teacup on his head and buckets of water being poured all over him while Martina now rattle over by tennis balls out of a giant teapot. And people say TV is dumbing down. I, I don't understand it. Nah, don't I really don't get it. Uh, so Martina and David had successfully freed the chest. All they had to do now was get it back and answer the question. I hear voices. Got the box. Yeah, there they are. Bravo! Bravo! Well done, guys! Yeah. Was it off? It was fun, but it was hard. Was it good? Oh, it's good one way of describing it. I can't even believe I've made it back. There it well, is. I'm still very long after hauling that chest around. I come what bearing gifts. Who's that sound David. Bite me! Oh, yeah. Hi, hi. David. Thank you. I'll sign the Oh, Joe. Oh. Oh. The woman's best and tennis player in the world ever, I presume. <laughs> Yeah. Love you. I've got a, a signed tennis ball. 
that says, Sujo, love you, Martina. That's amazing. Oh, for you, this is the wonderful <laughs> thing about surviving. <laughs> sure, it's all these wonderful memorabilia. Sujo, love, love, love for Martina. Love I'm just a bit gay if you put my name on it, otherwise I'll stick it on eBay. I'm only joking. Oh. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> well done, Martina, darling. Bravo, bravo. Can, Can I open this? Yeah, please. please. Okay. <laughs> I, I don't care what's in the chest now. Oh, the pressure's on. Oh, there's oh. more. How many? Yeah, read it, read it. Okay. In order to determine which side of the chest you open today, you must take part in a quiz and answer all of the questions correctly. Oh. Bloody hell. It wasn't a case of simply answering a question and getting A or B. We got 12 questions.